you have to give a hell of a lot of boosters to somebody who, like me to have the same benefits in terms of preventing severe illness of getting just one shot into somebody over 65 who has not received one yet, wherever they are in the world. And while in parts of the United States, there are still issues with vaccine access, but of course, we've managed to get a lot of shots into a lot of people, um, but there are still some who are, who are holding out. You know, a vaccine campaign is like climbing Everest. The first part is easy, and as you get closer towards the end of it, it's harder and harder because you're trying to reach those parts which have not yet had the shot. But boosters are for older folks who are vulnerable to severe disease. I think that that's defensible and reasonable. Um, but for younger people, the protection that is being gained there is not going to be a direct protection against severe illness. They're very unlikely to have severe illness if they've already been immunized. There may be a little bit of benefit what remains to be seen in terms of perhaps preventing infections and ongoing dynamics of that. But if you want to take this as a, as a global problem, then absolutely, these doses should be going to people who need them elsewhere. Because infectious disease is something which teaches you that selfishness is a really, really short-sighted thing because, you know, you might be looking out for yourself, but you need other people around you to be looking out for you if you are not going to get infected. And I wish that we had been able to learn a little bit more of that kind of perspective after two years of this.